Next, we're going to find the height of a pyramid, giving the volume and the base direct dimensions. So again, we're just going to be working backwards. We know the volume of a pyramid is one-third times capital B times H, where the big B stands for the base area. Okay, let's look for the given information in this problem. It says the base of the following pyramid is a square. If the volume of the pyramid is 360 feet cubed, what is the missing length? Round your answer to the nearest hundredth. So if I look down at the picture, it looks like my missing length is height. That's what we're solving for. And the dimensions of my square are 8 feet by 8 feet, which means the base area is going to be 64 feet squared. Let's use this information to substitute in and solve for h. So we know volume is 360, that was given to us in the problem, equals 1 third times 64 times h. So if I do out this multiplication and division, I would get h equals 16.87, ooh, sorry, 87, 5 feet. And because the problem tells me to round to the nearest hundredth, I would just round that to 16.88 feet.